morning, everybody. Time for your Monday morning fishing report. It's a quick one today. Don and I got out here. We left my house at 6.30 this morning in the dark. We had air temps in the high 40s. I got water temps at 51, up about a degree from yesterday. Had a nice warm night. Uh, east wind's still cranking. She's blowing, I don't know, 10, maybe 15, more like 10 to 12. Uh, you got one to two foot seas out here with a few white, you know, a few white caps and a couple good ones. I mean, coming out this morning or even since we've been drifting, there's been eh, a couple decent sized waves. Uh, this is quick because I'm going to go hang siding today with a buddy of mine. So Don and I have really just made one drift. I went up, I went right back down through our good numbers, my good uh, marks from yesterday. Uh, we've had two smallmouth? Two smallies. You had one, I had one. Yep. One walleye. One walleye and one perch. Well, and, uh, and a couple little perch and one jumbo perch. So five or six fish in one drift. We've been... We've been on this one drift for about 75 minutes, give or take. And coming down through in front of the red buoy right now, right in front of Anita Shores, there's the red buoy right there. Um, now yesterday, Todd Shelter and I had them all the way from the red buoy down, right down through the channel right here, all the way to the green buoy. I don't know if we're gonna make it that far on today's drift. Um, just cause it's been fairly uneventful. Uh, I got my smallmouth on a swim bait, that same Mega Bass has a dong swim bait. I went down to Lakeside Outfitters yesterday because I had, I had, I was out of them. And they're the only place locally that has the kind of tackle that they have. Um, and if you're like me, I love Japanese tackle. I love it. Hard baits, soft baits, to me it doesn't matter. I, I think that there's some of the you know, the big three or four over there, you know, Lucky Craft, Jackal, Evergreen, Mega Bass. Boy, they make they make some really great stuff. Um, and those guys have a have a wonderful selection of it. So I went down there yesterday and and uh, I, I did good though. I, I got out of there under a hundred bucks. And I got two little bags worth of stuff. Um, for a hundred bucks, but I, I, I did good. I did good, I controlled myself, but you'll see, and I'll, I'll, I'll show you later what I, what I got, a lot of white. A lot of white for me this time of year. White swim baits, a lot of white. Um, today it didn't really pay off, even though the solar lunar calendar said 93% excellent today. I'm sure if we had more time and we could get back up and, and do multiple drifts and really pinpoint them, I'm sure we'd be fine. Uh, we just, we just don't, I don't have that kind of time this morning. So, um, this is a, this is a quickie by all, <laughs> by all intents and purposes, this one's a quickie. Um, was a great weekend of fishing, started Friday, Saturday, Sunday, it was good all weekend. And again, I'm sure it'll be good today. It's just a matter of when. Um, the biggest bite window was in the next three hours, from nine to 12. Um, I'll be hanging off the side of a house, hanging siding, so I won't be out here. But I would think, you know, if anybody is out here, let me know in the comments below uh, and what they do this afternoon. We got, uh, we had a couple videos posted in the last couple days, full length videos. I hope everybody had a chance to watch them. Um, we're gonna we're gonna do something in November. We're closing in on 2,000 subscribers. Um, I'd like to I'd like my call to action for everybody that watches these videos is to share the videos on your social media and see if we can expand our range and get a few more people involved. Uh, you know, that's always the goal is to bring more people in, 
you know, if you've learned anything from these videos, if you enjoy them, uh, please be so kind as to share. It doesn't cost you anything. All you got to do is share it. And, then, and we're on three platforms. We're on Instagram, Facebook, and YouTube. And you can share any of the content on any of those platforms or all of them. I'd appreciate it tremendously. Um, today's baits of choice, like I said, I caught mine on that big swim bait. Don caught, uh, you caught everything on a blade, didn't you? I won silver with purple. Silver with purple tape. Um, and we did throw some other stuff. I, I threw... I threw a couple jigs, I threw blades myself early this morning in the dark, I uh, threw a glow shiver minnow, glow purple, it didn't get bit, you know, um, such is life. Had so much fun yesterday though, it was so good to see my buddy Todd after like three months hiatus where he's on the, he's on that lake boat every day, twice a day, you know, that's what, that's what full-time captains and charters do. And in the old days, that's what I would I would have done, and I'd have been out there every day just like he was. And and uh, but now it's fall, and him and I were talking about all the things we want to do this fall, from deer hunting to straight bass fishing down on the coast to anything in between. You know, we we'd really like to. Todd does a lot of fly fishing for big predators, you know, muskies and and northern. So we're gonna do that one of these days. I don't know if I'll be fly fishing, I don't know if my shoulder will take it, but I'll be throwing conventional. Um, so we got some cool stuff going on. We're going to try and get back up to the St. Lawrence for one more trip this fall for those big walleyes and smallmouth. So, and we're going to be back on the Salmon River too. You know, I've been saying it, salmon season's pretty much winding down and uh, now's the time to get out there and start really heavily trout fishing. And I want to do some cool stuff, you know, we've, we've got an in with with Zach at Great Lakes Steelhead Company. He makes incredible beads, ties some of the nicest marabou jigs, steelhead jigs I've ever seen. Um, and not to mention makes spinners too, which I love throwing spinners, whether it's for six inch stream trout or six to 10 pound steelhead, I love throwing spinners. So that stuff's coming too. We got, got a lot of good stuff going on. So I wanna thank everybody out there for watching us in here every day it's huge it's huge it's huge i i couldn't be more grateful that everybody's involved and in, in digging it and we got a lot of fun stuff coming up we got halloween a week from today you know and then it's november 1st water temps on the west end are in the low 50s it's game on you know yesterday was fun we had i had a stretch of six or seven casts where i had a i had a bass on a swim bait every time um hasn't happened today yet but it's still dark and early for the smallies. Um, you know, I've never done super well first light, last light for smallmouth. It's usually when you got more sun up. So we're going to get out of here on that note. For Don and I, thanks everybody for watching this morning. And as always, one, two, three. Keep your tip up. Keep your tip up, baby. Have a great week. Courtney, thanks for the muffin. <laughs> yeah, homemade apple muffins by courtesy of my beautiful wife, Courtney. Thanks, everybody.